transparent, translucent and opaque objects. In this module, you will learn to group the materials as transparent, translucent and opaque objects. Why does a ball cast a shadow when light falls on it? How can one see the other side of the glass container containing water? Cover a torch with your palm in a dark place. Now switch it on and observe from other side of the palm. For this activity, we need a cardboard, a metal foil, a sheet of paper, glass sheet, water, oil and a source of light. Take the glass sheet and hold it against the light rays. What do you observe? You can see that light rays pass through it. The lamp is clearly visible through the glass sheet. Similarly, when water is held in the transparent glass against light, the light rays pass through it, that is, you can see the light rays. The glass sheet and water are transparent objects. When light strikes transparent materials, most of it passes directly through them. Take a sheet of paper and look through it towards a lighted bulb. You can see that light does not pass through it clearly. Now spread few drops of oil on the sheet of paper. What is the change you observe? The oiled paper allows more light to pass through it than the plain paper. The oiled paper is called a translucent object. When light falls on translucent materials, light passes through them partially. Now, take a metal foil and put it in front of light source. The metal foil does not allow light to pass through it at all. Similarly, light doesn't pass through cardboard sheet also. Metal foil and cardboard sheet are called opaque objects. When light falls on an opaque object, it is either reflected by the object or absorbed and converted to heat. In this module, you have learned that when light strikes transparent materials, most of it passes directly through them. When light falls on translucent materials, light passes partially through them. When light falls on an opaque object, none of it passes through. Most of the light is either reflected by the object or absorbed and converted to heat.